this is the uh, whole pen for the goats to kind of clear this land for the next few days. We tend to leave them in a pen this size for two or three days, bringing them in at night and then bringing them back out in the morning so that they can eat all this forage and uh, kind of clear the property for us. And as you can see, they enjoy it a lot. We do set a water bucket out here for them and change it every day or so. I guess goats really like to have clean water, um, so we make sure we keep clean water there for them. Although they don't really drink much, I guess they get a lot of the moisture from the green plants that they're eating. Uh, the fence setup is cattle panels that we have put chicken wire on uh, with zip ties, but they do have a hard, the, the, the chicken wire is kind of sharp and it's kind of a pain, so we are going to get actual sheep and goat panels for the future. Um, we found a store in Southern States that has the sheep and goat panels for a reasonable price. Before, when we got these cattle panels, the tractor supply did not have the sheep and goat panels in stock, and even if they did, they were three times the cost. So it was cost prohibitive, but we found another store that has them for just 35 bucks, so uh, we'll be able to get those set up for future rotational pens. All right, well, Ash and Jethro are gonna eat for the rest of the day and uh, ruminate, and we will let them do that while we do other tasks.